Hi everybody. My name's Suzanne Montefanis and I work for New York State Parks, Long Island region. I'm an environmental educator and today I'd like to read you guys the story. This is the sea that feeds us by Robert F. Baldwin and illustrated by Don Dayan. This is the sea that feeds us. This is the sun that shines on the sea that feeds us. These are the plankton floating free, zillions of creatures alive in the sea making their food from the light of the sun that shines on the sea that feeds us. Here is a shrimp as small as a snail, lots of legs and squiggly tail, dining on plankton, floating free, zillions of creatures alive in the sea, making their food from the light of the sun that shines on the sea that feeds us. A curious girl with a sandy pail caught a shrimp as small as a snail, lots of legs and squiggly tail that ate the plankton floating free, zillions of creatures alive in the sea, making their food from the light of the sun that shines on the sea that feeds us. This is the wind, mighty and grand, that drove the waves upon the sand and made the gloomy storm clouds fly like airborne whales across the sky. The roaring wind and booming gale thrilled the girl with the sandy pail, who caught the shrimp as small as a snail, lots of legs and squiggly tail, that ate the plankton floating free, zillions of creatures alive in the sea, making their food from the light of the sun that shines on the sea that feeds us. A mother stood by the sandy shore, watching the ocean tumble and roar. She hugged the girl with the sandy pail and baited a hook in the blustery gale. With a little shrimp as small as a snail, lots of legs and squiggly tail that ate the plankton floating free, Zillions of creatures alive in the sea, making their food from the light of the sun that shines on the sea that feeds us. This is the fish with a hungry look that saw the shrimp but not the hook as the mother fished in the booming gale that thrilled the girl with the sandy pail who caught the shrimp as small as a snail, lots of legs and squiggly tail that ate the plankton floating free, zillions of creatures alive in the sea, making their food from the light of the sun that shines on the sea that feeds us. And when the wind has gone its way and the fiddler crabs come out to play, a barefoot man, all jolly and brown, built a fire as the sun went down. The people as they began to cook Thank the fish with the hungry look. They thank the sea that feeds us all, that feeds the creatures great and small, that feeds the crabs and feeds the whales and feeds the sharks and feeds the snails and feeds the ocean's fabulous fishes, a feast of their favorite seafood dishes and feeds each shrimp as small as a snail lots of legs and a squiggly tail, a supper of plankton floating free, zillions of creatures alive in the sea, making their food from the light of the sun and gone with the tide when the day is done, a drift in the sea that feeds us. Wow, that was a really great story. Join me next time. Till then, bye guys.